I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw William Frederick Cody, also known as Buffalo Bill. I take two fingers in the center and I put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a curve line down to the left, come back to the dot, curve line down on the right. I come over here on the right and I'm going to draw a straight diagonal up, curve line, curve line down, curve line around, curve line up, and connect. Right here I'm just going to bring this line down so it connects. I come right about here and I'm just going to draw a wavy, 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 wavy line and a curve line. Leave it floating. I come back up to the top and I'm going to draw a curve line down and leave it floating. I come on the inside. I draw one curve line, two curve lines, come back over here, draw another curve line, up, connect, draw another curve line, up, connect. Right in the center. Straight diagonal, curve line down and over. Right about here we're just going to draw a curve line wavy 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 line up curve line on the left wavy wavy line up connect right underneath put a little curve line and then we're going to draw curve line curve line curve line up and connect now we come back over here right about here we're just going to put a little curve line little curve line over and connect. This line we can bring down and connect. Come back over here on the left and we're just going to draw a wavy, 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 wavy line down. Leave it floating. We're going to draw a straight line down, curve line over, straight line up, leave it floating. Come back over here on the left and we're just going to draw a curve line down on the left off the page come over here on the right curve line down off the page come back over to the left and we're just going to draw little straight lines all the way over little straight lines all the way over and off the page okay up here we're going to write Buffalo Bill, Buffalo Bill and Wild West Show. Okay? Alright, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, if you have multicultural crayons, you can color in this space. This is all face. If you don't have multicultural crayons, you can leave it alone or you could cover, color it in lightly with your brown. Okay, then just to add some color, I'm giving him blue-green turquoise eyes. Alright, then I take my gray and I loop-de-loop -loop this space all the way down and around. He had long hair. Bring it up. He had a what we would call a walrus kind of mustache and then he had a beard. And once I've colored that all in, I've now recognized this should be his neck, so that should be multicultural cramp. Okay, there. Now, because he was a Wild West 
show entertainer. I'm just going to take my brown and do some loop-de-loop -loop over here and a loop-de-loop -loop over here. I'm going to take my brown and add some, this is his fringe on his jacket. Bring that up and around. And then I'm going to lightly color because this should be buckskin. It's not a real dark brown. It's a light brown. Buckskin jacket. Then I come up and I'm going to light brown color in his hat. He had a very distinctive look. He was a showman. He was a showman. Okay. You'll do a better job, but that's the general idea. Then, because he was an American, red, white, and blue. So I'm going to take my red and do parts of this red. I'm also going to come up and I'm going to put some blue. Red, white, and blue, because he took his show all over the world, and it was an American representation of the Old West. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is William Frederick Cody, Buffalo Bill, all colored in. He was a buffalo hunter, U.S. Army scout and had the Wild West Show, which was an international sensation representing the American West. Okay, bye-bye.